And now we stay uh, with this uh, topic and uh, Dr. Eric Moore will join me now and we'll talk a little bit more about bioanalytical chemistry. Welcome, Derek, uh, Eric. Thank you, Lenka, and good afternoon, everybody. So um, the, the postgrad diploma in bioanalytical chemistry, it's a, it's a level nine qualification that will provide knowledge of bioanalytical chemistry as applied in the in the biopharmaceutical industry. So very much following on from the, the conversation and topic that Owen um, was just talking about. So our program, um, it aims to deliver a broad scope of industry relevant bioanalytical topics that will give students viable insight and raise their awareness of the importance, implementation and impact of bioanalytical chemistry. Um, our modules are, are designed basically to give uh, or, or to, to deliver a more in-depth ap appreciation of the latest trends of bioanalytical techniques and state-of-the-art as well in terms of the, the analytical technologies that are currently um, in use in the, in the biopharmaceutical industry. And I suppose finally then, um, training is provided in a, in a wide range of bioanalytical analysis methods. Things like chemometric skills, literature searching, troubleshooting and problem solving are very key to the program and also our transferable skills such as scientific writing and presentation skills because there'll be opportunities as well within this um, to you know present on the project that the students will, will, will do as part of the course um, so they can basically showcase the work that they've been doing and give them an opportunity to disseminate their activities. Thank you. So in order to, to study your course, I would have to have a science or engineer, engineering degree, correct? So correct. why would it be important for me to study it a bit further? Why to go into the bioanalytical chemistry area? So I suppose in, in terms of, of, of bridging that gap between theory and practice, it's, it's, it's a key, it's a key, um, it's a key driver here. So, I mean, we've designed this program to enable our graduates to meet um, priority skills for the, for the bio for the biopharmaceutical sector and uh, a key aspect of this program is the partnering with with several industries like um, Pfizer's Regeneron um, Eli Lilly Johnson and Johnson workshop and Doan and so forth that provide valuable insight and skills and knowledge that really do bridge that gap between academic teaching and industry practice um, I suppose a major feature of the program is the proactive collaboration with industry. Industry are key to this because they are coming in at the beginning to help design and deliver the curriculum. Um, and this is highly innovative in terms of the approach that we're adapting here. And we see this as significantly enhancing the student learning experience. Um, like I said, this is this is very much an industry-led, industry-driven program. Uh, for example, you know, students will, will gain hands-on experience with industry partners through our dedicated industry workshops. Um, these will be delivered by the companies uh, and basically we just facilitate that. Um, there's also virtual gaming and these are based on industry scenarios. So there'll be a number of scenarios that industry have uh, and the students will have to go through these and troubleshoot um, you know, real life problems that, that these companies would have, would, would have had in the past. And also through you know, um, participation in virtual and also on campus laboratories. Again, this is a very important aspect for us because you know, this is an application driven program and the applied nature is very important that we can actually get the students to put the theory into practice. And, uh, you know, the virtual labs are great, especially in this environment where a lot of people are working from home. But there will be an opportunity, um, you know, in the summer because our program, our, our lectures would pretty much start, we're starting our workshops in December, but the core of our lectures will be delivered in semester two. And then our, our kind of applied aspects will be delivered in semester three during the summer side of it. Um, and we should have an opportunity for the students to come on campus and, and have a, a laboratory experience at that stage. Thank you. That That's really interesting. And, and uh, the key there is that the course, as you mentioned, was designed with your industry partners. So in terms of the career after completing this course, tell me just a little bit more about the type of jobs and maybe the companies within the area that uh, would be interested in this. So again, just following on from, from Owen, um, I mean, this is a very exciting time for the biopharmaceutical industry. It's a very challenging time, but, you know, but it provides a lot of opportunities for, for people to upskill and also to transfer into this industry. So traditionally, the biopharmaceutical manufacturing sector is very strong in Ireland. Um, it has an investment of over 10 billion in, in developing new facilities over the last 10 years in particular. 
Um, and as a sector, it's seeing very, very strong demand for new skills to be developed. Again, as our previous speakers like Patrick and, and Owen have been saying, you know, and this investment leads to, to basically new jobs and, and roles within the industry because it's such a diverse, um, you know, I suppose offering that's 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 there now. This course, um, in terms of the, the postgrad uh, diploma in bioanalytical chemistry, it, it basically has been designed, you know, to enable graduates to meet these priority skills. Um, especially for the needs of the biopharmaceutical sector. So students on completion of the program, you know, they will have a broader awareness of bioanalytical technologies, especially the techniques that, that are being used, and they'll be better prepared as well to fulfill new and emerging roles. And this is important because a lot of these, you know, there, there's a lot of a new new technology being implemented um, by the biopharmaceutical companies, um, especially in things like quality assurance and quality control within that 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 sector. So. You know, there's a, there's an awful lot of um, opportunities and and um, I suppose available to students who take this program, and the companies, like I said, this is industry driven. The companies are fully behind this, and they they really um, you know have have put a massive endorsement in terms of you know helping us design the curriculum, you know engaging with us in terms of being proactive in delivering it as well, um, especially facilitating the, the the workshops and and giving us a lot of content for helping us to you know move our our, our delivery to a, to an online, um, I suppose, forum as such. Thank you so much, Eric. That was, again, really informative 